अस्तिर सेवता हिमालयो नाम नगाधिराज पूर्वापर दोय निधि बगाह्य स्थित पृथिव्या इव मानदंड वि फिनिश्ड विद डिस्क्रिप्शन ऑफ हर दिस इज मल्लिनाथ ओके लेट मी शेयर द अदर बुक वन मिनट Ah, we finish with the description of Parvati, and we have to start on Narada's approach here. Hmm? So, Sarvopamadravya uh, samuchayena yatha pradesham viniveshitena ya uh, uh, sanirmita vishvasrija prayatnaate ekastha saundarya didrikshaya eva. So, uh, uh, when you describe the Naika, you have to now come to the prakaranam here. The prakaranam here is. Uh, the uh, union between parvati and shiva have has to happen and kumara sambhava so the context has to come about now so he is finished with the description of himavat parvata and parvati and now he goes on to who creates that scene here you know you should always have a sutradhara to start off the drama in the same manner narada comes in as a sutradhara So, so many people say that you know he is a kalahapriya, but his kalaham always ends in uh, something good. Always. So tam narada ha kamacharak kadachitu kanyam kila prakshya pitus samipe samadi desha ekavadhum bhavitrim premna sharirardha haram harasya. So such a beautiful uh, uh, shloka. I mean, every shloka is like that, but I love this shloka because uh, you know this is the first shloka in the kavyam. If you see, it is the first one that is a vachika, vachika abhinaya. Everything else is just angikam, or there is an aharyam, beautification, ornamentation. Angikam is anga varnanam. All these are there, but the first vachika, the first dialogue that happens in this kavyam is this. So tam narada ha. कामचर कदाचित कदाचित वंश नारद बिकॉज हि इज कामचर यत्र गंतुम इच्छति तत्र गच्छति सो कामचर हि जस्ट कीप्स ऑन गोइंग वेर एवर हि वॉन्ट्स टू सो इट इज नैचुरल दट नारद केम टू दिस प्लेस ऑलसो हिमवत पर्वत ऑलसो वंश सो कदाचित सह त्र आगत कन्या पिता समीपे प्रेक्ष्य किल किल यू कैन टेक इट एट दि एंड टू मीन हि अथ खलु इंडीड सो पिता समीपे कन्या प्रेक्ष्य आफ्टर लुकिंग एट पार्वती कन्या द डॉट द गर्ल नियर हर फादर हू वॉज स्टैंडिंग नेक्स्ट टू हर फादर ताम कन्या समाधि देश हि गेव हर दिस आदेश नॉट आदेश इट इज मोर लाइक आशीर्वाद एंड हिसे हरस्य शरीर प्रेमणा शरीरार्ध हराम एकवधूम भवित्रीम आदि देश दिस इज मोर लाइक अ वाचिकम बट इट इज नॉट अ डायरेक्ट Uh, shloka that is being said, that is what we say it is not a direct dialogue but that th- there is an it is like a reported speech so narada ha tam evam adi desha katham tvam harasya sharirardha haram harasya ekavadhum bhavitrim tam kanyam adi desha so that she is going to be the wife of ha- hara shiva harasya Shariraardha haram. She is going to take up half of his body, out of prema, out of love, and uh, eka vadhu. She is going to be an ananya sadharana vadhu in the sense advitiya vadhu. She is not going to be like any normal patni, but she is going to be a unique wife to Hara, to Shiva. Eka vadum bhavitrim samadhi desha. So the way it goes is tam kanyam. नारद समाधि देश सो नारद ऑर्डर्ड और नारद गेव दि अडवैस टू हर अडवैस ऐ थिंक ऐ नीड टू लुक एट मल्लिनाथ वाट ही वु गिव सम नईस डिक्लेर्ड आदेश दत्तवाई आदेश मोर नाट आदेश इट इज लाइक हि इज टेलिंग द फ्यूचर हियर Oh. he is predicting the future so he predicted oh. that she would become 
Uh, so the, he predicted that that kanya that girl would mm. become the bhavitri bhavitri she was going to become the ekavadhu of hara of shiva uh, ekavadhu ityukte unique unique advitiya eka mm. we look at the vyakhyanam he gives ధ్వని ఫర్ ఈచ్ అండ్ ఎవ్రీ వర్డ్ సో దిస్ ఇస్ అ కవినిబద్ద వక్తృ ప్రవడోక్తి వస్తున్నా వస్తు ధ్వని ఓకే సో ఫర్ ఎవ్రీ వర్డ్ హీ విల్ గివ్ అంగ్యార్థ హియర్ క్వశ్చన్ హియర్ can it also talk about the arhata that she she is the, i mean she she only has that arhata there yes yes she she is the only person because the next shloka also he will say mantraputam krishanoho rite anyatra uh, it is not uh, right uh, to give it in the hands of anybody else and she she has to be placed only in the hands of uh, shiva so ekavadhu so if we talk about arhata there then samadhi desha can you know that samadhi desha can fit more than like you know uh, she he munarda more like uh, predicted uh, no predicted or or you can say he just, he just declared he just declared probably yeah uh, that's more uh, uh, yeah appropriate uh, okay okay uh, so he just said that he she would become the wife of uh, shiva hmm? uh atha etat prakarana upayogi prakaranantaram arabhate etat prakarana upayogi ఏత ప్రకరణ ఇత్యుక్తే కావ్య ప్రకరణస్య ఉపయోగి ప్రకరణాంతరం సమారభతే ద కావ్య ప్రకరణం ఈస్ దట్ దే బోత్ హ్యావ్ టు మీట్ నో వీ హ్యావ్ స్టార్టెడ్ విత్ ద డిస్క్రిప్షన్ ఆఫ్ ద నాయిక అండ్ దెన్ వీ హ్యావ్ టు మూవ్ ఆన్ టు ద నెక్స్ట్ సెక్షన్ ఆఫ్ ద పోయం కావ్యం విచ్ ఇస్ హర్ మీటింగ్ శివ So, Naradaha, Kadachite, Tam Kanyam, Pituhu Samaype Prekshya, Harasya Yekavadhum Bhavitrim, Iti Samadhi Desha Kila. So, he did say that and Narada is Ityanena Shraddheya Vakyatvam Uktam. Each word he is going to say is a Vyanjaka here. So, when you say Narada, then it means that we can, it is a very trustworthy person and we can believe whatever he says. So, Shraddheya Vakyatvam Uktam. If Narada says she is going to become the wife of Shiva, then definitely she will. Because uh, in uh, Uttarama Jaritam, he says, no, Laukikanam hi sadhunam vagartho anuvartate, Rishinam punaradhyanam vacham artho nudavati. Rishinam pun, Laukikanam hi sadhunam. Normal people who say words, they will say something because they know what is going to happen and then they say something whereas if it is rishi nam punar adhyanam if it is a rishi whatever they say vak artham anuda artham vag anuvartate artham goes chasing after that vak and it wants to make it uh, 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 it has to realize that vak so it is uh, they randomly say things and then it becomes true so the, the normal people only say things which are true or which are going to happen parantu rishinam punaradhyanam vacham arthaha anudhavati arthaha tu anudhavanna gacchati so naradaha ityanena shraddheya vakyatvam uktam so it, it, it's a trustworthy words that uh, because narada has said it sahi parameshwarasya asanna sevakaha he is one of the sevaka for parameshwara also we think because he is saying narayana narayana it is uh, he is vishnu's sevaka na trimurte uh, all three people he uh, uh, does puja for all of them so kadachit ityanena naradasya yadrichikam agamanam narada can go whenever and it is not a planned visit but he suddenly lands up there iti pratipaditam tam purvokta sakala guna vishishtam అనేన హర యోగ్యత్వం ఉక్తం దిస్ ఆన్సర్స్ సి ఏకవధూ న తాం ఇది పూర్వోక్త గుణ విశిష్టా సకల గుణ విశిష్టాం తాం వెన్ యూ ఎక్స్ప్లెయిన్స్ లేటర్ ఆల్సో హీ విల్ సే సి వేర్ విల్ ఐ గో హనుమ హిమవాన్ మై డెవ్ బీన్ థింకింగ్ దట్ యు నో షీఈ్ సో బ్యూటిఫుల్ వేర్ ఎమ్ ఐ గోయింగ్ టు గో లుకింగ్ ఫర్ అ హస్బెండ్ హూ ఈస్ ఈక్వల్ టు హర్ అండ్ వెన్ నారదా కేమ్ అండ్ సెట్ దిస్ he uh, became relieved that he didn't have to go anywhere else to find out for a husband because shiva was shiva's place was kailasha you know he was residing in kailasha he was uh, performing the tapas there 
and uh, so he didn't have to go anywhere else right so kanyan ityanena pituhu tad uchita bhartra chinta vyajyate kanyatvam it indicates as soon as she becomes a kanya it is the duty of a father to search for a uh, appropriate uh, uh, husband spouse so tata eva naradasya samadesha avakashah dvanyate that's why narada came at a time when she had entered yavvanam and she was in that kanya avastha otherwise his uh, uh, his timing would have been off whereas here his timing is perfect santaha hi kanya darshane pitradi pritaye bhavinam artham adishanti so bhavinam artham adishanti usually they declare what is going to happen when they see a, a kanya a girl and in order to please the father so the father or the parents the first thing they will always feel when a daughter is of marriageable age they will want to get her married and so their worry is centered around that girl and so in order to please that father that parents they're not going to say your you, you will get a lot of wealth or something like that but then uh, this is something that will relieve them of some worry pituhu himavatah samipe anena naradasya devi darshana upavatti utta just as how you know brahma wanted to uh, see the shakti and he used all of the upama dravyam to build her form the same way here also when narada came he came at a time when parvati was standing beside her father or you know even when uh, uh, he came to meet himavan it is natural that the girl they would call the girl and ask her to get aashirvadam and all right so na pituhu samipe ityukte naradasya devi darshana upapatti it is Uh, 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 an opportunity for narada also to have a darshanam of uh, shakti prekshya samyag avalokya atrapi pra ikshanam khalu so anena naradasya tad guna avalokanam tadrsha aadeshe hetuhu iti after looking at her well he also realizes who she is and then that is why this this adesham that he gives later ekavadhum bhavitri meti adeshah api atra uchitah eva iti vaktum prekshya iti uchyate loka drishti anusarah vyajyate i mean loka drishti anusarah ityukte what he says is uh, normal people you know when they see someone who is very beautiful or who has a lot of good qualities they will naturally say she is going to get a, an anurupa bharta and lokadrishti anusaraha api he he is uh, he is doing something which a normal person in this world would do bhuloke yah kopi katham aacharati iti tadvat narado api aacharati iti tatra drishyate hmm हरस्य परमेश्वर से एकवधूम एकाम इति अद्वितीयाम अनेन पत्न्य भाव उक्तः पत्न्य भाव हि टेक्स इट वेरी नॉर्मली हियर एंड सेस यू नो शी हि डजंट हैव एनी अदर पत्नी सो दैट इज व्हाई शी इज गोइंग टू बी द फर्स्ट वधु अथवा अद्वितीया वधु अन्य फॉर विष्णु व्हेन लक्ष्मी गॉट मैरिड टू हिम bhuma devi also became another uh, wife there were other wives also in other avatarams we don't have such a uh, this thing ganga is not treated as a wife at all you know ganga is just there uh, on her head and uh, it just becomes a play for these ka- kavis to bring in that uh, pranaya kalaha that's all but she is never declared as a wife anywhere so she only parvati is going to be the ekavadu that is why she was born as sati and she again is reborn as parvati nobody there is no other second wife for him tarhi patni abhavah iti uttah samadhi desha samyak adi desha atra bhavyartha katanam adeshah ityuchyate so is very clearly he is saying bhavi artha katanam means it is only prediction right it is not a declaration then भाव्यर्थ आदेश पुराण प्रसिद्ध अयम अर्थ इति ध्वन्यते फ्रॉम किल वी अंडरस्टैंड दैट इट इज अ पुराण प्रसिद्ध 
in the uh, the purana references are given by mallinatha uh, by Ka- kale in his uh, vyakhyana he says um esha bharya jagat bhartuhu vrishankasya mahidhara sharirardha hara devi bhavishyati na samshaya he takes a reference and uh, gives that it is from history aitihyam is what he is saying we don't know uh, which puranam he doesn't give any purana reference there but yeah etavan matram api pituhu manoratasya api abishayah etavan matram api pituhu manoratasya api abishayah tatopi adhikam kinchit asti iti premna sharirardha haram so your father was first very satisfied if there is an uchita varaha tatopi adhikam kim ityukte premna sharirardha haram premna snehena na tu dakshinya adina it is not out of pity or it is not out of protection that he has taken up uh, uh, parvati but it is out, more out of uh, sneha sneha bhavena atra sharirardha haram uh, bhavitri sharirardha haram uh, there is a small discussion about this sharirardha haram Uh, where ardham napunsakam when you take the word uh, the sutram ardham napunsakam it is usually upasarjanam purvam so there is a purvanipata and you will have to say is ardha shariram ityeva vaktavyam parantu he does not take it as that he says sharirasya ardham harati iti and in uh, bhattoji shabdakostuba also he gives this particular shloka as an uh, example and uh, uh, you know he says you don't need to take uh, ardham pipilyaha as a shashti samasa or uh, badham and you can just take it as uh, a, a karma dharaya and get done with it whereas here you can take it as sarirasya ardham the whole discussion is a little uh, um, too much into grammar so i'll just avoid that so sharirasya ardhaharam iti vigrah swikarat naradasya yadrichika devi so vigrah swikarat ityukte the thing is it is not some swikara it is not something that she just took over or uh, the tatvam behind this sharirardha hara is we'll have to look at bhaskar raya for uh, shrikantha ardha sharirini shrikantha shiva is akara akara shrikantha iti uktam so it is more like she is the vagbhava vagrupa parvati is like the vagrupa and akara is shiva so it is only a shiva shakti aikyam there shiva shaktya yukta so that is the point here it is this haratvam or uh, haranam or grahanam it is not uh, 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 how uh, you know like a hunter takes the life of someone not something like that but sharirardha hara is more to do with the vak and artham being together always just as in uh, uh, the first shloka of raghuvamsha right vagartha viva samprakto vagartha pratipatteye jagata pitaro vande parvati parameshwara so in uh, lalita sasramam he says shrikantha is akaraha and uh, sayeva akaraha asyaha vagrupayaha ardham vagrupatu bhagava uh, uh, shakti and shakti uh, sh- shakti he ardham roopam tu akaraha in the sense even though there is 51 aksharas akara akaraha vai sarva vak esha sparsha ushma bihi vyajyamana bakvi nana roopa it is only akara and its different forms are the entire uh, uh, set of alphabets so parvati is the vagrupam it it also coincides with the thing that he is the purusha akaraha is the purusha swarupam and the prakriti swarupam or the shakti swarupam vagrupa is uh, shakti parvati that is the concept of this uh, sharirardha hara vag udbhuta para shakti hi ya chidrupa para bhida vandeta manisham bhuktya shrikanthardha sharirini ಶ್ರೀಕಂಠಾರ್ಧ ಶರೀರಿಣಿ 
I also heard it in Mahabhashyam. Akaro vai sarva vak. Ah, maybe he has quoted from uh, Mahabhashyam. Hmm. Hmm. Could be because the uh, Bhaskar Raya is a 15th century um, author. Ah. Okay. So he must have quoted from Bhashyam. He doesn't give the source in the Bhashyam. Hmm. Oh, that is good. Nice. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. So a quick question here. So the yeah. Pituhu Samipe there, right? Huh. Pituhu Himvataha Samipe. Anena Naradasya Devi Darshana Upapattihi Ukta. Hmm. So how, so even regardless of whether we say Pituhu there or not, right? If you just say Tam Naradaha Adi Desha, even there you get the Upapatti there, right? You know, so that Pituhu Samipe, you know, what, you know, what does it actually signify there? He cannot go and directly view a kanya. Only oh. if she stands near her father, there is an opportunity for him also to view her. Okay. The, uh, the, the way I actually uh, ah. read it is, when yeah. you say Pituhu Samipe there, and he's hmm. talking about, you know, you know, Shiva is going to be your husband. Hmm. Uh, you, you, the Auchityam there, you know, is, you know, he can't direct, like you said, he can't directly say this to Parvati, but, you know, he's saying it right in front of her father. Yes. That is the autism that I, I took, but you know, your is also very good. You know, he can't do good, direct, can go and uh, talk to yeah. him. Yeah. yeah. Okay. 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 Right? Hmm. That's why. <laughs> Even though she is Shakti Swarup, uh, Shakti, and uh, she is Lokamata, Tattu Tadanantara Meva. He may know, Narada may know that she is Sati and she, he can go and visit her. But then in this, given this context, she is a Kanyastri and she has to be beside her father for him to see her. That's right. Tam Narada Kamachara Kadachit Kanyam Kila Preksha Pitus Samipe Samadhi Desha Ekavadhum Bhavitrim Premna Sharirardha Haram Harasya. She will look at Mukapanchashati for this. Raka Chandra Samana Kanti Vatana, Nakadi Rajas Thuta, Muka Nama Pikurvate, Suradhuni, Nikasha Vagbai Bhavam, Shri Kanchi, Vihara Rasike, Shokapahantri Satam, Eka Punya Parampara Vijayate, Akarini, Eka Punya Parampara, Pashupate, Akarini Rajate. The status that she is going to get because of marrying Shiva. Is something where, you know, in Mukha Panchashati, it's the beautiful piece where he shows the Shakti uh, Mahatmyam. And he says, he's, she is the Punya Parampara of Shiva that she was born. It's because of Shiva's Punyam that she is there. She is a personification of that merit, that Punyam. Punya Parampara Akarini Rajate. Huh? The, the, that is her, that is the status that Shiva is going to give to her. Tam Narada Kamachara Kadachite Kanyam Kila Preksha Pitus Samipe Samadhi Desha Ikaladhum Bhavitrim Premna Sharirardha Haram Harasya Guru Pragal Bhepi Vayasya Tosyaha Tastho Nivrittanya Varabhilashaha Rite Krishanor Nahimantraputam Arahanti Tejamsi Aparani Havyam. Now, after hearing this, even though, you know, Parvati had reached the stage of Yavvanam and where the father has to start looking for a, a prospective groom, he still stopped looking anywhere else. Because the only place that she has to go is uh, uh, to Shiva and uh, nowhere else. Mantra Putam Habyam Krishanoho Rite Anya Tejamsi Aparani Tejamsi Na Arhantihi they do not deserve to be a uh, mantra putam habyam. And a, a, a habya vastu, which has been purified by mantram, deserves only to go into a fire because Krishanu is called uh, uh, habya vahanaha. Even if devas come and stand nearby, near the yagashala, you are not supposed to give them in their hand. Give that habyam in their hand. You will, you will have to say indraya idam namama and put it only in the agni. And agni has to give it to uh, the devas. So, mantra putam habyam tu atraiva arahati uh, krishano. So, krishano ho rute aparani tejamsi mantra putam habyam na arahanti. So, Guru, the father also decided, even though pragalbhe api vayasi asyaha, even though she was Parvati, was in a pragalbha vayaha. 
pragalbham is uh, yavvanam praudham even though she had reached an advanced age or a, an age of mature age when she should have probably gotten married many girls would have at least gotten married of her age but uh, bhimaman did not even make an effort to look for another uh, 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 husband because ataha ataha ityukte purvasmat shlokat from because of this ataha narada vachananantaram evam nischayam akarot so nivritta anya vara abhilashah he had no desire for another groom anya vara abhilashah nivrittah it he has stopped looking for any other person and just stood tastav tastav ityukte gati nivritti hmm? he did not move forward even in his mind not just physically go roam around and find a groom but then even in his mind he stopped thinking about anybody else chatra narada aadesha anantaram pituhu pravrittim aah so is talking about what uh, uh, as soon as narada came and said this and declared and went uh, what was the course of action what is the next course of action that uh, himavan took undertook ataha vishwasana hmm, vishwasaniya ah okay ವಿಶ್ವಸನೀಯ ನಾರದ ಆದೇಶಾತ್ ಹೇತೋ ಬಿಕಾಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಕೇಮ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಅಟ್ ಅಸ್ ಅ ಟ್ರಸ್ಟ್ ವರ್ತಿ ಪರ್ಸನ್ ಹಿ ವಾಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಹಿ ಸ್ಟಾಪ್ ಲುಕಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎನಿಬಡಿ ಎಲ್ಸ್ ಅಸ್ಯಾ ಪಾರ್ವತ್ಯ ಪ್ರಗಲ್ಭೆ ಪ್ರೌಢೆ ವಯಸಿ ಯೌವನೆ ಅಪಿಶಬ್ದ ದುಹಿತು ಯೌವನಾವಸ್ಥಾಂ ಪಿತು ತಥಾ ಅವಸ್ಥಾನ ಅಸಂಭವ ದ್ಯೋತಯತಿ ಈವನ್ ದೋ ಶಿ ವಾಸ್ ಇನ್ ಹರ್ ಪ್ರೌಢ ವಯಸಿ ಅಡ್ವಾನ್ಸ್ಡ್ ಏಜ್ Uh, usually parents do not uh, just keep quiet when the ch- children are of that age they want to immediately start looking for uh, some groom hmm? but he remained set in his idea that he will not give parvati to anybody else tasya cha muni vachanam eva hetuhu iti suchayati nivrutta anya vara abhilashah nivruttah vyavruttah anyasmin bhagavad vyatirikte vare vivah kartari abhilashah nivruttah he had stopped his uh, uh, desire in anybody else other than shiva bhagavad vyatirikte vare in the previous shlokam when you say hara the word haraha itself does not mean just a samgyavachi hara but you should take it as an arthantra sankramita vachidvani because the he's talking of parvati as being a wife of hara not only a simple wife but then ekavadhu the uh, uh, premna sharirardha hara haraha ityukte she he is you it is like uh, you know when you say ramosmi sarvam sahe we use this uh, uh, example in kavya prakasham there is this, you know aha devi dhira bhava uh, there are a lot of uh, clouds and the, uh, rama is separated from sita and uh, this is a shloka that rama is talking and uh, he says you know uh, the uh, megha uh, uh, the uh, the sky is filled with clouds and during this rainy season it is very natural for uh, a man to miss his wife more and so i am fine you know ramosmi i am rama so i can tolerate all this viraham but how will you tolerate haha devi devi dheera bhava you have to be strong because i am afraid for you there that rama doesn't mean dasharatha putra rama ha you will have to take it as kathora hridaya rama ha one who has killed so many rakshasas so i can easily withstand this separation and this grief but sita is not used to all of these things so that rama padam there gives you so much of meaning behind it the same way in the previous shlokam also when you say hara it does not mean just shiva or the one who is just doing tapas na yogi nam apyagamya and uh, you take you can, because this is kalidasa's work you can take all the three mangala shlokams that are there in natakam uh, one is shakuntalam where he says shiva is the ashtamurti ya srishti hi srashtu radya vahati vidyutam if you look at malavika agnimitram it's a very beautiful verse also that is also talking about uh, yogi nam api uh, not yogi nam api agamya adlena um, ekaishwarye sthito api pranata bahupale look at that shlokam also you can take whatever uh, whatever you want i think the um, arunachalanatha says that here ha i forgot to mention that here harasya ityatra tu yatha buddhi vyangya arthah anusartavya natu samhi matram 
so when someone is talking of parvati as being a husband being a wife to hara who is not a samgni matram kintu uh, you're talking about the adi purusha here right and uh, who is always doing tapas uh, his description will also be very beautiful behind that is why that so uh, himavan is justified in not looking for another vara that I, is I, I, i didn't get huh. it though in the previous one when you said hara is arthantara something samanya you said huh. arthantare sankramitam you don't just take it as hara is equal to shiva hmm. it's not like a dictionary word that you are talking about hmm. you will have to look at all the different qualities that go behind the word hara hmm. you you will have to think of him as ashtamurti hmm ಹರಸ್ಯಾಟಿ So when you say arthantara sankramita can you repeat that what you said arthantare sankramitam sankramitam vityukte it goes and ends in some other meaning other than uh-huh. its vachyartha uh-huh. so, so it arth- goes into the vyangyartha ha uh-huh. ha ha okay uh, okay got it hmm? okay got it so now you know you understand the term so sankramitam now it crossed over that normal limited meaning that you have yes antare like in to another artha it is sankramitam okay yes anyaha arthaha arthantaram arthantare sankramitam mm mm but mm. so premna hara nama she has no now no, that premna is going with hara there right so she is also a hara like akaranta stridinga shabda premna sa hara bhavati ha <laughs> oh, so true <laughs> yeah like shiva and shiva ha ah. ah. correct Hmm. So he is justified in not looking for another person. Hmm. Uh, so vare bhagavad vyatirikte vare vivaha kartari abhilashah yasya tata vidah. So tasthau gati nivrittau iti dhatuhu mano vyapara nivrittihi eva atra vivakshita. He had not started to look for any other bride. He had not physically sorry groom. He had not physically gone to look for a vara. But here, mano vyapara mati abhi atra nirvritam yataha naradasya uppihi asita tata. Right? So, mano vyapara nirvrittihi, he stopped even thinking about another vara. Lokati shai, this is the explanation that he gives. Lokati shai lavanyam arudha yavvanam for a girl who has a beauty that is beyond this world. Lokati shai lavanyam arudha yavvanam who is... Uh, uh, advanced in age tanayam evam avalokayann thinking looking at her himavan bhagavad vyatirikthasya kasya chidabhi devyaha asamanatvat he had already decided it seems that you know there can be nobody who can uh, be equal to her other than shiva so bhagavad vyatirikthasya kasya chidabhi kasya chidu anyasya api devyaha asamanatvat bhagavatah tu manorathanam api agamya manorathanam avishayatvat one cannot just randomly sit in your dining room or living room and think that okay shiva will be the wife of the husband of my daughter even though he is himavat parvata he is still cannot just decide that manorathanam avishaya he is not a, 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 a is not a subject of his desires right so kova me duhituhu bharta bhavishyati iti vyakulaha abhut so himavan must have felt very upset when he saw his daughter who is so beautiful and she had also entered yavvanam nobody other than shiva can marry her who is equal to her who is who can go and ask him because he is some someone beyond our desires huh? so he was very upset and then narada adesha anantaram naradasya adesha anantaram tu nirvyakulah abhut tasmat anya vara nivritta anya vara abhilashah so just for this word he is giving this explanation <laughs> so atra 
हिमवान भगवद्व्यतिरिक्तचिदी मंत्रपूत हव्यम दिशा I was going to ask Arthanta Ranjana here, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> yes. Mantra Pootam Havyam Krishano Ho Rute Aparani Tejamsi Na Arhanti. Maybe you can also explain this as Drishtanta, Bhetreka Drishtanta, no? No, Drishtanta. How do you ah, but, explain Drishtanta? No, 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 no need Drishtanta. Right? No. No, there is no bimba prati bimba bhava. It is only samanya visheshan, and it is arthantar nyasa. Yes. Arthantar nyasa. Yes. 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 When you do, when you do drishan, the drishtanta. Can you give a quick example before we move? Drishtanta. Um, Prabha. Um, Adina. Nahi. Uh, Shuras chape na rajate. Uh, Adida ne. Ila. Bimba prati bimba bhava. In an English, it's more of a chinna explanation. Ah, the it's only a bimba prati bimba bhavam. So there are two sentences where you have different uh, sadharana dharma, and mm. uh, um, the upa, there is an upamana vakyam and an upameya vakyam. But the sadharana dharma is very different. You have expressed it in such a manner that there is a bimba prati bimba bhava. It is like a reflection. Uh, okay, then that is samichi na matra kela. Matra tu yagnya se vishaye uttamasti na tu vahasya vishaye. निवृत्त अन्यवर अभिलाषा दट से There is only a justification in the second half using a samanya. Okay, so so there is no bimba prati bimba. There is no comparison literally here. Ah, uh, if there was a comparison, then we could have said bimba prati yes. bimba. Yes. Then the yes. Chance. But yes. because there is no comparison, and then you can say it's arthantara nyasa. Hmm. Hmm. There is a justification here using yes. the samanya. Okay. Atvameva kirtiman rajan. Rajan ne. Vidhureva hi kantiman. Kantiman. Ah, yes. Ah, atvameva kirtiman rajan ne. Vidhureva hi kantiman. So atvameva kirtiman itu pet raja eva ki raja kirti yukta ha asti. Chandra ha to kanti yukta ha asti. So here that kanti and kirti are your sadharana dharma. There is no sadharana dharma here. The quality which qualifies the king is different from the quality that qualifies the moon. Yet you are placing it in such a manner that it seems like a uh, person and its reflection. Uh huh. Okay. Hmm? Yeah. Is that Kuvale Ananda? Ah uh, yes. That is Kuvale Ananda. विशेषणम् So when you say mantra putam, it indicates that the all the different qualities with which you have uh, uh, you know qualified the devi in the earlier shlokas, purva pratipadita, vishwa atishayi guna gana, or uh, sarvopamadrapya samuchchaye na. It's like she is she is gone beyond beyond the world. Uh, you can't even take all the upamadravyam and compare her with that. So tadrisha vishwa atishayi guna gana se varnana ate. प्रति वस्तु भूतम इधम विशेषण इत इज लाइक दिस मंत्र पूतम इज लाइक अ काउंटर एग्जांपल और अ काउंटर उदाहरण फॉर हर देर इज नो अदर उदाहरण फॉर हर दि ओनली उदाहरण दट यू कैन से मंत्र ही पूतम हव्यम 
um just like let's say you know in uh, ananya alang ananvaya alankara you say gaganam gaganakaram sagara sagaropamaha ramaravaneyor yuddham ramaravaneyor yuva eva you cannot compare gaganam with anything else the sky is like sky if i say something like that that is its comparison so in the same way here for me to compare devi the only visheshanam that i can say is mantraihi putam tarhi atraiva tyajyam you know you have to give that mantra habyam mantra putam habyam only in that agni in the same manner just as how etadrsha guna vishishta devi haraye eva datavya na anyatra prati pratibhuta vas prativastu bhutam nama kim prativastu bhutam is like a reflection it's like a, a, um you are um, so we just talked about how parvati has not been mentioned in the shloka right in the first half mm. but then where is she mentioned you will have to take all of those that have been mentioned earlier and this mantra putam is indicative of parvati it is like a prativastu bhutam in in the sense it is the uh, object that is being indicated for parvati in the shloka so if you are looking for how is parvati indicated in the shloka then you say that mantrehi putam habyam is equal to it is parvati so uh, i mean so prativastu is agni va allala prativastu is man uh, putam habyam aha so prativastu is the vastu that is standing in lieu of ah yes okay okay um instead of parvati the vastu that you are being indicating you are indicating her as is habyam okay okay so habyam havihi krishanoho rute agnim vina uh, this is the sutram for that anya aarathu itara iti rute iti panchami aparani anyani tejamsi surya chandramasadini na arhanti hi prasiddhau yatha mantraputam havihi krishanuhu eva arhati तथा तामपि हरहायेव इति भावः नेट क्लियर हम कृषाणु रेता इज द नेम ऑफ शिवा आई थिंक न न न कृषाणु हु एव ओ दैट इज यस हां राइट कृषाणु रेता सर्वज्ञो आई थिंक इट्स द नेम ऑफ इट्स नॉट शिवा यस सो आई थिंक द वर्ड कृषाणु इज गोइंग बैक टू is hitting about that i think <laughs> yes krishanu and he is also an agni swarupam right um uh, tejas swarupa eva yeah isn't that right uh, uh, i am uh, am am tikar ji hmm. yeah shujayanti ji yeah krishanu is one of the names of uh, because shekar ji is one of the fans of amar kosha that's why i'm asking him <laughs> i don't remember that uh, you can check the dictionary Yeah, yeah, I'm just taking that. We heard for Agni as well. Krishan, the Krishan or Reta, right? Agni. But what about Krishan or Reta? Ah, Krishan or Reta, right? No, no, Hiranya Reta is uh, 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 Agni himself. Krishan or Reta, ha, is Mahadeva because he's uh, you know uh, because he carried uh, the bijam and went. Uh, that is how uh, uh, Guha was born. Correct. Correct. Hmm. वन तेजस निषेक आसी तदनम वन श्रवण प्रतिनीतवान् खु दिसवण yeah that is why he is called krishanu reta the, the line was krishanu reta sarvagnyo dhujjatir neela lohita haras marharo bhargha trayambaka stripurantaka ah okay so mm-hmm. they, I, i i like that fact that he used that krishanu very sp- i mean i mean probably amar kosha predates kalidasa maybe i don't know um possible yeah maybe yeah or it is doubted no i don't know the absolute okay okay, okay. Mm. sure <laughs> guru pragalbhe api vayasyato asyah tastho nivrittanya varabhilashah rite krishanor nahi mantraputam arhanti tejamsi aparani habyam 
Okay, alles klar.